Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to have a brief insight about artificial intelligence and data science. Artificial intelligence and data science are the common buzzwords that you get to hear nowadays. But what exactly are they? Are they same? What are the difference between these two? Well, let's find out. What is artificial intelligence? Artificial intelligence can simply be stated as the development of computer systems being able to perform tasks which normally require human intelligence such as visual perception, speech recognition, language translation and decision making. Looking at the history of AI, we see that the term AI was coined by John McCarthy at the Dartmouth Conference in 1956. The Dartmouth Conference, also known as the Dartmouth Summer Research Project on Artificial Intelligence, is considered to be the birthplace of this field of research. It was a two-month, ten-man study of AI held at Dartmouth and the proposal was to discuss about computers, natural language processing, neural networks, theory of computation, abstraction, and creativity. The development of AI research was relatively slow. But recently, we have seen an exponential increase in research and development in the field of AI. What might have caused this to happen? The exponential increase in data and computational power propelled AI research to be the next big thing. Many big companies have started investing in AI technologies to make use of this data and make the systems more intelligent. This can be very evident from the AI systems you use in your daily life. Now let us discuss some AI systems that we use in our daily life. Email services such as Gmail uses AI technology such as machine learning to filter the mail that you receive. It automatically filters the mail as spam, primary, promotion, etc. into different categories so that you get to see what really is important to you. It also provides a smart reply feature that helps you reply quickly by showing a suggestion of the possible replies. Some of the common voice assistant systems such as Google Assistant, Siri, Cortana, Bixby, Alexa uses AI technology such as natural language processing, speech recognition to provide optimum results for the users. Navigation systems use real-time data and AI algorithm to suggest the best route available. Social media such as Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn to name a few and others uses AI recommendation engine systems to recommend posts or content which may be more personalized to you. YouTube recommending this video is also an example of an AI algorithm at its work. Facebook uses another AI algorithm which analyzes a post by a person to check if the user may be vulnerable to self-harm. Chatbots are now widely used to resolve customer queries by many companies so as to reduce the processing time and to improve customer service. Google search algorithm uses an advanced AI algorithm to provide recommendation based on your usage pattern and location. Ok, hope that gave you a brief insight into artificial intelligence. Now let us look into data science. Data science is an interdisciplinary field that uses scientific methodology, algorithm, statistics and data analysis techniques to extract meaningful insights and knowledge from data that can be structured or unstructured. Structured data are often categorized as quantitative data that can easily fit in databases or spreadsheets. You might probably have come across these kinds of data in your day-to-day -day life. This is mainly sorted and organized in databases by a language called the Structured Query Language or SQL. Unstructured data are those that cannot be processed or categorized by conventional methods. This kind of data mainly consists of audio, text and video files. As you know, a large amount of unstructured data gets generated through the internet by each passing second. And unstructured data constitutes more than 80% of the total data generated. Getting meaningful insights from these datasets can inquire a lot of cost and time. Now let us look at some of the steps involved in a data science process. The first step is to define the business problem. The success of a data science project depends mainly on understanding the business problem. During this stage, the data science professionals often sit with the project stakeholders, asking them questions to get a clear understanding of the business problem and what they are trying to achieve with the data. 
This also helps to develop a clear plan on how to achieve the required goal. Once the problem statement is clearly defined in step 1, the next step involves collecting the required data or formulating methods to collect the required data. This can be done by obtaining the data from the respective owners, buying the required data or collecting it from repositories. This is the data in the raw form which needs to be worked on. The next step is to clean the data. This is one of the most time consuming and lengthy process in a data science project. This involves processing the raw data into usable form that can be used in our models. The raw data can often be very messy and difficult to process as it may contain errors such as missing values, null values, corrupted values and invalid entries. If these issues are not fixed, the model might not give a desirable result. After this, we move on to the exploratory data analysis step. Now the data is cleaned and ready. The next step is to explore the data that we have, that is to find the patterns in the data and draw conclusions from the existing data with the help of visualization. This helps to give us an idea regarding the trend in the current data. Then we move on to creating a model. This part involves using different machine learning algorithms to build a predictive model that best fits the data. The model is trained on training set and tested on a testing set to identify how well the model fits the given data. This is done for many iterations and after this the model can be used to predict the outcome of a product and how well it performs in the future. The final part in the data science process involves visualizing the results obtained from the model in a readable and user understandable form using various visualization techniques such as Tableau, Power BI and communicating these results back with the client. Well, that concludes this video. Hope you got some insights into artificial intelligence in data science. If you like this video, please hit the like button and make sure to subscribe to get more videos related.